around the back entrance to my school. Wow. That's really nice because the rain oh, is crazy today. That's the cool part about this is the uh, pretty farmland, tons of flowers. Mike didn't take us this way last time, I don't think. Jump for the high jet! Dang it, high jet! And yeah, that's a pretty common traffic scenario back there. Oh, I'm sorry, am I in your face? Let me go around you and high five your mirror. Ooh! Oh, there Mom, those are peaches. Had a flashback from Half Life. <laughs> Tentacle things. Uh, thank down. you, thank yeah. you. They're ruining the rest of my day. So yeah, I didn't know uh, why there were so many things of this farmland not being used, but apparently, um, modern machinery came in and people started farming using, you know, machinery and the steps stone steps do not allow for any machine based anything like it's just impossible to lug it up there yeah you can't get this so also a lot of it's really soft mud mm. only held up by a loose pile of rocks so apparently that style of farming is going to disappear in japan it's not going to be here anymore because nobody can continue it and of course young people are like you expect me to <laughs> do what exactly by hand yeah so we have machines. Now. Yeah, people are they're having a real shortage of farmers here. There's some kind of like incentives, I think. Like we've seen farmers with Lexuses, I think, because they've got cash incentives for people to produce in-country Japanese produce, like you know, food, any kind of food. It's like please make it so you don't have to import. That's why you see some and tractors, Coke. And, uh, tractors, and different farming implements that are smaller than a go-kart. They're adorable, but they're that small because if they were any heavier, be able to bring it they up. would just sink into the these farm plots. Oh, Never yeah. Back. It's like a little sort of tiller planter machine that has the rice paddy. Oh, I think we're getting close. Is that... <laughs> yeah, I think that's it. <laughs> oh, is that Daisha? <laughs> yeah. Oh, just hi, high jets. <laughs> An army of high jets. If you're a farmer in this area, you have what is called a high jet. It is a mini truck, but it does the job. It's like someone bolted an engine to the front of a wooden pallet. <laughs> yeah. A seat. Mila! Blue pots. Whoa. I really want some more bright red car. And I think this is the neighborhood where a bunch of my kids live. <laughs> this is the highway. Or one of them, anyway. I love the colors of hydrangeas oh, wow. they had here. Hi, lady. I'm going to film you. That whole tree giving her shade there was infested go, go. with grapevines. He's trying to get out. Come on. I love hydrangeas. It's the best thing about the rainy season, and the Japanese use it as a time marker. Ever seen an anime where they had rain and a bunch of hydrangeas out there? Whatever they were doing? It's an indication that it's June. <laughs> flowers! How do, you, how do you pronounce that flower's name again? Ajisai? No, no, in English. Ajisai. Hydrangea. Oh, yeah? Why are you getting on my case about how I pronounce it? Is it because I reamed our daughter about it? Is that it? Oh, don't do that to me! <laughs> oh man. I think it's a wrong turn. The southern showing y'all. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Nope, that you show to the right. <laughs> then what was the school we saw to our left? I... I don't... 
But really? It says it says that he show. I don't know. Turn right at the mud patch. Yes, yes. There's a kanban on the right. And uh, oh, there it is. There it is. See the gym. There's the gym. Oh, is that what gym is in Japanese? Hi, good girl. Kanban. No, well, no, ka- ask some American companies. They know what a kanban system is. Oh wow. Nice pool. Ha! <laughs> Guess what? We were so broke <laughs> that the kids and the teachers got out there, got totally soaked and muddy and full of bugs and algae and everything that it collected over the last however many months, and they cleaned the pool. And now we have a pool. I don't and, think it's that they're poor. I think it's that it's their pool and well, who else is going to clean it? Well, one, that yes, that makes sense, but apparently I asked them and they were like, uh, usually we hire someone to do that. Oh, did they? <laughs> We can't, we can't hire anyone. Um, you can drop me off here and come out if you want, I no. think. This, this is Jim and somebody's house. Oh yeah, this is the lady who's also is planting stuff and the kids go by and they're like, hi! Just wade through the mud, honey. You'll be fine. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna drive you up. I'll never well, get home. Aren't, aren't you supposed to feed? The most biatchinist playground ever. Kids are always like, get in there! I'm like, I can't! You're all tiny! Too huge! Fun fact, the women of Japan are the smallest on Earth. And they remind you of it every time you gain an ounce. Well, they don't remind you that they're small. They, they remind just... you that you're big. <laughs> yes. Ah. <sighs> you're laughing, said that I have jowls now. <laughs> no, they said it looked like you were pregnant this time. Oh, that's it. <laughs> No, that's better. Then they, then they said it looked like I had a second one. We were like, are you okay? I'm like, thank you. Take a right thing. Uh, you have arrived at your destination. Go, Jack. 